Zoom box. Lots of coffee selection. Caffeine is good. Oh, this university banners. Vanilla is or not. Oh, pumpkin spice. That's in season. I got an iced latte because it's really warm today. All right, we're heading out. So that uh, 2004 GT3 with an RS kit, really cool. We'll get some details of that later. The boys over here met this guy just now at a gas station. Manual box for us. That's my ride today, the M3. It's gonna be a little loud and a little uncomfortable because of the harness, but you know what? It's a good thing. Engine start and here to start up. Push start. We got an old RS6 here, straight V10, very nice, and an R32. The R32 we get in America here. Sad. That's a hot cookie. A couple hidden cars here. We got a red two, S2000, Z07. I don't know what color that is. And five pre face lift. And a couple of like oldies here. SC, GT3, racing yellow in the overflow lot. Dial 993. That sounds like it's super, no, sorry. Not turbo Here is the biggest meet of the month at Hayfields. It's a coffee shop um, and they host car meets. The van's here down there, you see it? We'll go there later. Got a Lime Rock Park edition. Pretty cool. I haven't seen one of these in a while. Matching plates. And the popping exhaust. 964 Turbo. These guys are pulling in. Markers. Uh, just like you know, uh, and a red ZR1 here, very uncommon to see. Blue brakes, chrome wheels, one of my favorites. DB4, wow. RS4, really cool. RS V8, that's a Fjord Green Touring, we'll come back. Yesterday, so I think he has an Astoro Blue uh, E46 M3 with uh, T wheels, and on his page, he posted this car as well with the uh, cinnamon interior. So this is apparently a Ferrari red F80 M3, really cut, really cool, and the new RS3 that we never got in Canada. Good size, really cool. This is an Oslo Blue 992 Turbo S, super cool, black caliper, ceramic brakes, blue stitching. 
sharp loop stitching to be exact. Really cool. Not sure if this belongs to uh, some of my follows. So every hour they rotate all the cars in here and the cops, you know, they're using the PA system to help the uh, coffee shop here, which is like really nice. Small town things. Yeah, you're not going. Be Lime Rock. We saw this car at the last meet. The guy redid all the engine and re zinc plated everything. Super neat. Redid the interior as well. Here we have a Midnight Purple R34 uh, GTR. Yep. Um, it's kind of cool, but the paint is kind of questionable. Big exhaust, really cool tinted plate frame. You see how the color changes from purple to bronze. I don't know if it's midnight purple two or three. It's one of those. One one changes into green, and the other one turns into brown. Paint looks a little rough, though. Might need a polish or something. Z-Tune style fenders. I don't think these are authentic Nismo parts, but they're reps. Vented hood. Also not an authentic Nismo hood, but still cool regardless. Z-Tune style bumper. Cool. 305er tires, kind of cool. We got an E24 and E30 M3 over here. Really nice. 997 GT3. And a 7.2 to be exact. Folding bucket seats, really nice. That's one of the things I need because you can actually use the back even with the cage. BBS E88, I think he was at the caffeine and carburetors meet one, one, the first one. Sorry, not the first one, maybe a third one, but the September version. I think this is a Callaway Corvette C4. Twin turbo. Ah, look at these headlights. They're facing backwards, kind of cool. Always racing. Cool tail lights. They look like the tail lights from the 456. 968 Club Sport. We got a one of one British Racing Green RS3 with red contrast. This green and red kind of goes well with each other. Nice VBS wheels. an original super here. That's the move. Can't forget the Aero Atom with everything exposed. Super cool. Carbon fiber wheel arches. Getting buckled in. Removable steering wheel. Kind of cool. The engine's just in the back. You can cook bacon on these things right there. Like look inside. Nothing. Steering columns right there. Got a Ferrari Daytona here. Yellow, really nice. I haven't seen this in a minute. Look at the seats, Daytona seats. Uh, get it, matching. Really nice yellow. Daytona Violet F80 M3. Got a grabber blue uh, GT350, really cool. Let's see what's oh cafe racer. Here at the mechanics or 1600 Veloce on Bringer Trailer, they sell a lot of cars here or restore or whatever. But let's go check it out. A couple Ferraris here. That's in a uh, dark green, a speciale. F8, 599, and these are either 550s or 575s. Let's go see. So both of these are actually manual, which is sick. And they're actually both 550s, it says in there. 240, nice. And a Fiat Bertone. RFC Motors. Hello, Ray. A12 just started up. I don't know 
what this is, but it looks like a presidential limo. By Cadillac. Flags, curved windshield. That's gonna be expensive. Super cool. It's auto. Dividing glass. Ashtray, more seats, extra seats. Basically a couch in there. And these aerodynamic fins. Let's see if you go fast enough, this car might actually take off. Carbon wheels on this F8, really cool. Got a white M4 GTS here. I kind of like how it is originally, but I do like the uh, one with the GT4 kit more. Oh, I think that's a V12 vantage. With the hood scoops. Got another track prepped uh, E92 M3 here. That's great. Or Python Green GT3. Ceramic brakes, current bucket, silver stitching. This one has a cage with pole positions. Also a DCT, GT4 style wing. Garo stick, that's kind of cool. Kermit, that's very original. A couple of F80s here, there's a little F80 meat here. Your inside mechanics is a turbo 3.6 here. Really cool. And I think there's a couple other cars on the side. One of them is a right-hand drive Testarossa. All these fabrics, really cool. We have an Alpha GT 1300 Junior. The curved glass, really cool. These period correct wheels. Super cute, super cool. The green 280S out here. Super pretty. Fully restored. I like E24s, but I don't know what color this is. It's got some carpeting on the inside. Oh my god, look at those seats. Ooh. Wait, what transmission does it have? It's got a dog like transmission. That's rare. Um, just going back and forth. Oh, this is the early model. But I'm pretty sure the early models have like the speedo in the middle instead of like you no know, left and right. There's an Alpha 130 foot one race car. Look at the shifter. We got an Iron Man motorcycle. That's sick. We got PTS RS and this exclusive design uh, Carrera 4 GTS. Nice. Here at the Lake Valhalla Club for the uh, Cars and Cafe special display. We're parked in the street right here. All right, so we're at the Valhalla Invitational. I came in a little late, oh, that's kind of cool. And uh, it's raining, spectators. There's an hour left, but um, I'm still here. So this is supposed to be a meet, which is a nice place. There's even food here, it's just the weather sucks. Maybe this might be the best time to come because you can see everyone leaving, which is really cool. Diablo in the rain. I think they're trying to get a photo of these two cars together. Side open like this. It's really cool. The Aztec Pior. That's it. Open it. I don't know anything about this car other than it's probably powered by an Audi engine and produces 250 horsepower. You might have to look it up. It's called the Aztec P1? Question mark. Tail light from an Alfa Romeo. Gauges from a Ferrari. Cluster. That's the passenger side. When you um you, you don't want to talk to your driver. 
The lightning. Oh, the skyline levels. Howdy. Ooh, that's kind of cool. We got a roof 930 here. Really cool. Looks better when it's wet. See you inside. Uh, you can't really see it. Roof W09. Oh, that's the VIN number that roof cars get. Special version. Cool. We got a Testarossa with a funny horn. A couple cars here. Oh, I've seen this before. I think it was a car week. Super sport, really cool blue. We got, don't know what that is. We got a uh, R34 here. We'll find out what version it is. Skyline's getting a crowd, literally left, right, center. So I thought this was like a uh, Alpha from like really far away, but apparently it's a Lambo. I don't know what model it is. Probably find out in like a few seconds. Pretty cool. What's it say? It doesn't say anything. That hatch look. It is a Jamara. We're out here spotting cars and spotting planes now. I don't know planes, but that looks like an AC-130. So this is the um, GT500KR. I don't know the significance of this, but um, I think it's special. <laughs> So in here we have a Monza. This is probably like my 40th Monza. After seeing like 30 of them at Car Week. Pretty cool. Little detail. Big brakes. Painted shields. Based on a 12, but with no roof. When you want to go driving, buy yourself. It's got a trunk. I can sell my too. collection and maybe buy one of these. That's all carbon, which is really cool. That's the inspection. Here at this mall for lunch, and there's a chalk GT3 here. M4. Uh, Missed the startup. There's a Turbo SE hybrid in the mall in matte black. I think it's a Turbo S, let's see. Yo, they put the most expensive Panamera in a mall with like people around it. 